What's going on everybody? It depends on who you ask here and today I'm coming at you with another Steam Summer Sale video for the 2019 Steam Grand Prix Summer Sale. Now yesterday I did just a brief overview of some of the sales and I also did a giveaway of Assassin's Creed Origins. So if you guys still want to enter that giveaway you can still do that, you just need to go to the last video, I'll have it linked in the description, and you have to like it and leave a comment and make sure you're subscribed, and then you can get a chance to win Assassin's Creed Origins. But anyways, let's get on with today's video. Today, I'm going to be going over the top 10 games that I would get for $10 or less during the Steam Summer Sale. Now, these are in no particular order, I just kind of found the 10 games that I would get so I have them up here on 10 different tabs and I'm about to show you them. They will also be linked down the, in the description. So first up we have Rust. Rust is like a sandbox survival game where you essentially collect resources, build forts, try and raid other people's forts, stuff like that. It's got extremely positive reviews, over 200,000 very positive reviews. It is Normally $35, but it is 75% off for $875. This is actually the lowest I believe I've ever seen it. So if you guys want to check out Rust, there will be a link in the description. Definitely go check it out. It is a very well received game and I highly recommend it. Next up we have Rise of the Tomb Raider. Now you could probably get just about any of the Tomb Raider games except the newest one for under $10 but this one was on the best deal I believe I've ever seen it. 85% off for $9 or it's normally $60 but that's because of the 20 year celebration. So not only are you getting the base game you're also getting the season pass. And this game is now VR supported as of, I believe, like a m couple months ago. I'm not sure. So if you guys want to check this out, it's a very, very well done story based uh, single player like puzzle type game, puzzle slash action. It's very well received, 40,000 positive reviews, $9 if you want to check that out. All right, following that we have Payday 2. Payday 2, again, this game is on the best sale it has ever been on. In fact, it has never been this low before. Two fifty for the original game of Payday 2, or what I would recommend is five fifty for the Ultimate Edition bundle, which comes with thirty seven DLC items. That includes like maps, weapons, stuff like that. This the Ultimate Edition, in fact, is what I bought a few years ago for like fifteen dollars when it was on sale. And I highly recommend this game. It is a blast to play with some friends. So if you're going to get it, I would recommend you also tell some friends to get it or buy it for them. But even without friends, it's still a great game to play. Uh, it's like a heist game where you team up with three other people, either randoms or you can play with bots or your friends, whatever. You rob banks or you rob different things or try and complete like these different challenge type things. And it was received very positively. I believe it was given out free a few years ago. But if you don't have it, I would still highly recommend buying it for this price. It is a great deal. Following that, we have Zombie Army Trilogy. Now, this is not a super well-known game. But I have played probably 15 hours on this game with a friend. And it is great. And... <sighs> Something I should probably clarify, Zombie Army Trilogy is actually, it combines three games from uh, Rebellion Studios. Yeah, you can see right here, it combines Nazi Zombie Army, Nazi Zombie Army 2, and I believe there's a Nazi Zombie Army 3 somewhere. I'm not sure where it is, but Zombie Army Trilogy combines the three games, and it's on sale right now for $9 instead of $45 which is a great deal. In fact, you could also get the 4-pack for $27, also a great deal. Now this, again, this is a game you want to play with your friends if you can, but if you want to try it solo, you can queue up with randoms. It's a really, really good zombie shooter and sniping game. If you played Left 4 Dead ever, you'll probably like this game quite a bit. Following that, we have Just Cause 3. Now, again, you could get Just Cause 2 also for like $1.50, but Just Cause 3, I believe, just has more stuff in it, more things to do. Uh, for $3, 85% off, it's definitely worth it. 
just there's so many things you can do. It's like an open world destruction type thing where you can literally do whatever you want in the world. Or you could also get the extra, extra large edition for seven and a half dollars. Now this comes with like map expansions, uh, more missions, vehicles, weapons, stuff like that. This is actually what I have and I've had a blast playing it. I actually uh, played probably 50 hours of Just Cause 2 on my PlayStation 3 back in the day. And I recommend both of those games. They're both great. So if you want to pick up those for just a couple bucks, I would highly recommend it. Feel free. Next up, we have a game for our horror people, which I'm a huge horror fan, and I figured I'd throw this in. Outlast 1 was on sale for $4, 80% off, normally $20. I don't think I've seen it this low before, and with 30,000 overwhelmingly positive reviews, I had to throw it in here because this game, it's like one of, Outlast is probably one of like the top three most well-known horror games, and Man, this game will give you chills. But not just that. What actually I also noticed was down here, buy Outlast Trilogy Bundle. Now this comes with Outlast 1, Outlast 2, and a DLC for Outlast 1 called Whistleblower. For ten sixty one. I I know that's a little bit more than $10, but if you want to go for that, definitely worth it I would say and one more thing Outlast 2 is actually on sale for 750 so if you already have Outlast or you just want to get a newer version like a better whatever of the game then you could get Outlast 2 also for under ten dollars if you just want to get Outlast 2 so definitely check that out and now we have Soma now this is another somewhat of a horror type game but it has more story than Outlast It's more of like a like a a uh, story driven horror game. Soma has 14,000 overwhelmingly positive reviews. It's on sale for 450, normally $30. I own this game and I would definitely recommend checking it out, especially for that price. And even better if you want to get the uh, frictional collection bundle, which comes with Soma, Amnesia, The Dark Descent, Amnesia Machine for Pigs, and I'm sorry, I don't know how to pronounce this, but Penner, blah, 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 blah. Um, collector's pack, which I believe comes with like three games. Um, those are all really good horror games. I believe I have all of those games, but that is seven dollars ninety one percent off. It's an even better deal than just buying Soma. So definitely check those out if you are into that type of game. And now for Borderlands Two, many of you guys probably knew it was going to be on this list. I had it on my winter sale list. And it's just it's just that type of game. It always goes on a good sale, and it's just a good enough game that you have to put it in there. Ninety five percent positive reviews with ninety six thousand reviews. It's just it's crazy. So it is on sale, seventy five percent off for five dollars. This game just I I've seen people with like thousands of hours in this game, and for a co op shooter, it just it blows my mind. So yeah, you guys can pick this up for $5, and if you want, you can get the 4-pack for $15, which, that's pretty good if you want to play this with some friends. What I would recommend, instead of getting the original game even, is getting the Handsome Collection, which is $230 worth of content for $5.90. You're getting, like, every DLC, almost, for Borderlands 2, for $5. That is a heck of a deal. But if you don't want to go for that, you could spend more money to get the Game of the Year edition, which comes with less content. So yeah, if you're that kind of person, I mean, yeah, you just do whatever you want, man. Moving on, we have Bioshock Infinite. Now, again, all of the Bioshock titles will be on sale, but Bioshock Infinite is just known to be, like, the best one from what I've heard. I actually have not played the Bioshock titles yet. I'm sad to say I really want to. But 95% positive reviews, 60,000 reviews, it's on sale for $750, 75% off. It's normally $30. Definitely, I'd say this is definitely worth checking out. If you want the Bioshock Collection, you can get all three games, I believe. Bioshock Remastered, Bioshock 2 Remastered, Bioshock Infinite, and it gives you the Season Pass and like three other DLCs. So $15 for that, if you want that. Definitely worth checking out. Again, links to all these games will be in the description. 
And last but not necessarily least, For Honor. Now this game wasn't received quite as well, but I've played it quite a bit, and honestly, it's it's a good game. It's worth this price easily. Six dollars. It's sixty percent off. Not the best deal I've had in this video, but for the content you're getting, you can get six dollars worth in just a few hours easily. And if you have a few friends, you can queue up with them and have a blast in this game. It's it's really quite fun. So I hope you guys enjoyed that video. If you want to see more steam deals or slash sales or whatever for the summer sale i am going to be making videos every day today's video was like the best games under ten dollars i'm probably going to do like the best games under five or the best games under 25 or the best under 50 or whatever and if you guys want to see those videos make sure you subscribe turn the bell notifications on and and please like that smash button also, what I normally do a little bit later into the sale is I'll make a top 10 best deals like overall once I've had a ton of time to look at all the deals. So that will be the best deals of the entire sale to get your money's worth. So if you guys want to see that, make sure you are subscribed and have notifications on. Anyways, if you guys wanted to enter my giveaway for Assassin's Creed Origins, the link to the video will be in the description. Make sure you click on that because I don't have many people entered yet. In fact, I think it's like five. So yeah, you have a pretty good chance of winning. Anyways, thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you in the next one.